Neighbors pushing back against asylum seekers coming to their community as groups on both sides turn out to demonstrate. Good evening, I'm Christine Johnson. Some Queens residents are protesting the new facility for asylum seekers expected to open in the borough. CBS 2's Ali Bauman is in Queens Village with more. City officials expect to open a relief center here for up to a thousand men seeking asylum within the next few weeks. But some residents out here say, not in my backyard. Hundreds of Queens Village residents rallied outside Creedmoor Psychiatric Center Tuesday night where humanitarian tents are almost ready for asylum-seeking men to move in. Creedmoor is on state land and the state will reimburse the city for building this relief center. Mayor Adams says the facility is necessary without federal help and with 57,000 asylum seekers currently in the five boroughs. Protesters here said they do not want the migrant men moving into their residential neighborhood. Tensions flared between protesters and counter protesters here. If pedophiles are not allowed to live within a school zone area, we don't know who's getting a background check on them, correct? We don't. Queens is a, is a borough of immigrants, and um, we, we want to really fight back against the right wing propaganda and xenophobia that we're seeing here today. And five busloads of asylum seekers are expected to arrive in New York City from Texas before morning. From Queens Village, Ali Bauman, CBS 2 News.